Good afternoon, friends. Stephen Benoon here with Israeli News Live. And uh, today I'd actually got a message in, and uh, it appeared to be uh, that we were getting a presidential replacement. And uh, but and, and I still don't know the full answer to it. It's one reason why I said I needed to verify the information. I got this particular uh, text in today uh, that spoke about Thursday afternoon. President of the United States of America, Kamala Harris, uh, was going to be speaking there. And that's actually at the National Baptist Convention there uh, in Houston, Texas. Now, I think, though, what it is is they're covering up the word vice president of the United States of America. I've got a good friend of mine there in Houston, Texas, actually at that particular uh, convention. Uh, he sent me this right here. And of course, it looked like that we were actually getting a presidential switch uh, nonetheless. But uh, at any rate there, it was released <clears throat> by the uh, uh, they were saying Kamala there. Harris will visit Houston next week. The White House saying she'll be here for two days. Thursday, she'll speak at the National Baptist Convention, and then Friday, she'll visit the Johnson Space Center. So I do want to make sure that I correct that there. That's my assumption there is what it was speaking of there. Uh, but also, too, <clears throat> to share with you there, that was also on the, on the uh, flyer there where you catch that corner right there, the... First Lady Helen Young. I was wondering who that was. And we see right here, this is where uh, Barack Obama and of course uh, his wife there, that's hard to say, but anyway, Michelle Obama. Uh, church honors Dr. Jerry Young and First Lady Helen Young for 41 years of pastoral service there. So it's a very big political movement that's going on. And that's actually what's going on there. <clears throat> and of course, it didn't help matters none that I saw this video up here too. Uh, now I don't know if this is really Naomi Biden or not. It has her voice pattern sounds the same, but this is just about as conspiratorial as you can get. And this just came out as well, so I'm going to play this for you. This is kind of what kind of fueled all of this uh, information there. Uh, and uh, but like I said, I wanted to double check on these things. It, it has not been still. Clear, clarified to me, but I was told though that this is part of the plan for pumping up uh, the African American political plan. Uh, this is why Kamala Harris is visiting visiting the uh, National Baptist Convention there in Houston. And uh, <clears throat> but anyway, let me play this right here. And there again, I don't know if this is really Naomi. Uh, like I said, sounds like her, somewhat looks like her. But listen to this clip right here. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. Actually, I want to use the better audio, uh, the better audio is on this version of this right here. Let me play this one for you. Let's go. I probably shouldn't share on the internet, but I'm going to do it anyway. Um, my grandfather, Joe Biden, does have a twin. And that twin is currently pretending to be Joe Biden in the White House. Um, so... Unfortunately, my grandfather, Joe Biden, passed away about four years ago. Um, but, you know, he had built up this really long political career. And my family still wanted to have a bit of power in the U.S. government. So we just replaced Joe with his twin brother, Bo. Anyway, don't know what you think about that. I, I'm not an expert on this. I did uh, I did listen to, um, that's Naomi as well right there. Like I said, it does look similar. Uh, I did listen to an interview that she was in and uh, did sound very, the voice sounds a lot like her. But there again, you just never know nowadays, uh, even like in this case here, uh, because I don't see the entire document there. I'm assuming that Kamala's already taken the place of president. Um, but I think the word vice is hidden under there. So I wasn't able to confirm that yet uh, with a friend of mine that's actually at that Baptist convention. But I think that's actually what it is. It's just the fact that uh, she's there as vice president. And, and the big issue, too, is because I already know that there's been a lot of talk of her replacing 
uh, President Biden because of his health issues. And so uh, that was one of my concerns there. And like I said, then you get this video surfacing about allegedly Naomi. Uh, so a lot of issues going on there. Just have to wait and see how that plans out uh, or pans out, I should say. And then also, um, you know, who knows? Who knows what's going to happen next there? Anyway, Stephen Benoon with Israeli News Live.